The share allocation in Burger King India's 810 crore rupees IPO, which closed last week, has been finalized. All investors who had applied for obtaining the quick service restaurant's shares in the IPO can now check their share allocation status on the website of Link in Time, which is the registrar for the Burger King IPO. All you need to do is click on the link, select Burger King India Limited, and enter your PAN details. You can alternately enter your application number, DP client ID or account no IFSC. Once the details are entered, enter the CAPTCHA text and click on Submit. Investors can also check their share allotment status on the BSE website by following four easy steps. All you need to do is select Equity, select the issue name, Burger King India, enter the application number and PAN details. You can then click on the search button. Investors will be able to see their application status and also the numbers of shares they have subscribed allotted during the IPO. All you need to know about Burger King India IPO According to brokerages, Burger King shares are likely to be listed on the BSE and NSE on December 14. The Burger King IPO was a hit as it was oversubscribed with a few hours of opening for subscription last week. The price range for the IPO offer was fixed at Rs 59 to 60 per share. The retail individual investor segment was subscribed 68.15 times while the portion meant for QIVs was subscribed 86.64 times. Meanwhile, non-institutional investors subscribed it 354.11 times. The 810 rupees crore Burger King India IPO included a fresh issue of shares worth 450 crore rupees. Reports suggest that Burger King India plans to use the proceeds from the IPO to open new stores in the country and reduce debt. On December 1, Burger Kind India had raised 364.5 crore rupees from anchor investors. It is worth mentioning that Burger Kind India is among the top three most subscribed IPO this year along with Happiest Minds Technologies and Mazagon Dock Shipbuilders. At present, Burger King operates 268 stores in India, most of them owned by the company. However, the burger chain wants to have at least 700 restaurants in India by 2026.